Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I have a hair tutorial for you all. I am absolutely obsessed with these curls. They're just really, really nice. Um, they're really easy to do and they're perfect for either as an everyday look or even for a special occasion with the holidays coming up. So with that, let's go ahead and just get straight on with this tutorial. So I'm starting off with my natural straight hair, which I showered the night before, so this is like the morning after. And this video, I'm going to be using the GHD Curve Creative Curling Iron, and this is absolutely amazing. I'll get into it in just a little bit. But first, I'm going to section my hair off into two big sections, a bottom portion and a top portion. I'm just going to clip those up. So again, this is the GHD Curling Wand. And I love using curling wands. And no, this video is not sponsored. I just am obsessed with this curling iron. So what I'm gonna do is take a section of hair about an inch, um, and I'm gonna go ahead and literally just wrap it around the curling iron, and that's it. Just hold it for about like five seconds, not even. Um, and there you go, you have a perfect spiraled curl. So I'm gonna do that again, but show you this time, instead of holding the curl as it falls, I'm just gonna let the curl go just like that. And you'll see that I get two different types of curl. I'll have more like curlier one and a more wavy one. So the type of curl you get depends on the technique you use to like let the curl go. So for most of this, I'm just gonna be letting my hair fall. I'm um, just like so get those waves, but I will be using a couple where I hold it a little bit just so I get a little mix and match with the curls throughout my hair. And I am curling away from my face, but I will be curling some strands towards my face just to again have that variety and make my hair look a lot more full. So as you can see here is me just doing a couple curls and that's what it looks like. We'll have some longer ones and some shorter ones and then I'm just going to continue doing that throughout my entire head of hair. And there you go. I'm finished with my bottom layer of hair, like bottom section of hair and there you go. We have all the curls. And then I'm just going to go ahead and repeat and do that with the top section of the hair. And I'm splitting this into two sections just to make it a little more easier for me. But yeah, separating those two and then just going with the same technique that I've been doing. So what's cool about this curling wand is that GHD has mastered everything about the curling wand from its design to tiny details like the silicone tip and bottom stand piece. Now this curling iron only has one temperature because GHD found the right curling temperature for all hair types, which is 365 degrees, at which point your hair is most malleable and least damaging. They also have this tri-zone technology which makes sure the entire curling wand remains at that temperature when most curling irons just have one sensor, which is why some parts are more hot and some parts are more cool. This one just delivers constant heat throughout the wand, which is why it's so easy for me to curl my hair and have that uniform curl throughout like my entire piece of hair and throughout my whole like head of hair, which is why I love it. Now again, this totally is not sponsored. I literally just love this product so much along with all the other GHD products. It's definitely worth the investment. So remember when I said the temperature like makes it malleable? This is what I'm talking about. So this piece of hair, I didn't hold it long enough, um, so it's not as curled, but all I have to do is kind of fix the curl. And then with this one, I held it on for a little too long, so I just kind of pulled it out to make the curl a little looser, and that's because my hair was at its most malleable point. Okay, so for the bangs, I'm just gonna be curling the very bottom of my hair and then just doing that really quickly and then letting it go just because I want um, the front of my hair, like the bangs, to frame my face. So that's why I curl the front piece a little differently. But all right, moving on to the other side. And then again, for my bangs, I'm just gonna be doing a little bit lower, um, just so it frames my face well. But okay, so now that I have my finished curls, I'm gonna go ahead and move on to styling. Now, if you like bouncier curls, this is exactly where my hair is at, but I wanna make my curls a lot looser, so I'm just gonna shake them out, and you wanna run your fingers through your hair from the inside of your hair so it doesn't ruin those outer curls, and I'm just shaking those out until I have a more desired amount of curl. And lastly, I'm going to set my hair with my Sebastian hairspray. I'm just spraying that all throughout my entire head of hair. So the curls were still a little too curly for me for this particular look, like they're beautiful, but for this look I wanted them to be a little softer, so I'm just brushing it out and just pulling it down to make it a little softer. 
And that's it. We have the finished look here. And again, it's great for everyday curls or for a special occasion. It's a super easy, quick hairstyle to do. I think it took me like 20 minutes and I have a lot of long hair. So it's really, really easy. Like, yeah, you can see I have a lot of long hair. So it's really, really quick. The curling one basically does everything for you. And as you can see, my hair is still super shiny and healthy, um, even though I do use heat on it a lot. So really really amazing i'm obsessed and if you want for like a special occasion or just anything like that you can go ahead and tie your hair up and it makes a really really nice full curly ponytail as well like that so that's great or even like at the end of the day um you can go and just put your hair in a ponytail and it's still super super cute but yeah thank you all so much for watching if you're interested in this makeup that i'm wearing for this tutorial i also have a makeup tutorial posted with this makeup or like a tutorial on this makeup if that makes sense but yeah definitely check that out and i'll have a link to this curling wand um, in the description box below but thank you all so much for watching and i will talk to you all in a future video bye